All right, so I'm going to be going over how to use eToro for cryptocurrency in 2021 and if it's worth it. All right, so I've had a good experience on here and you're going to see my account is actually up quite a bit. You know, I put uh, 1500 in when I got started, but I had to sell $750 of it because they delisted XRP, which was one of the coins I owned. But uh, right now I've got Tron. I'm actually up 158% on it. I think I got it, what, around three cents, which is really cool. So it's up um, and I plan on holding it, right? Now, as I'm going over eToro, if you guys do want to get started here, I'll throw some bonus and sign up links in both the description and comments. And of course, if you have any questions about using the crypto here, uh, feel free to message me below. Now, the cool thing is about uh, Tron is that I've actually been paid like some free money, kind of like some interest, some dividends. It's actually one of the staking coins available on here. So they do have two coins out of the 15 that you can buy, um, which are available for staking Cardano and Tron. Um, and then some other things that you can do on here, which is really cool, is that you know eToro is basically like a social trading app. So you can chat with people in these like built-in communities around these coins. Um, you can see this guy's got Tron going to a dollar next step. That would be absolutely insane. I don't even know what the market cap on Tron would be at that point. It'd be ridiculous. But yeah, so I'm just kind of like liking this post, chiming in, you know, and uh, you can actually make friends with people on here too, which is pretty cool. And this is actually one of like the only cryptocurrency trading exchanges and I guess you could even say apps that allows you to like make friends with people. Now you can do some of the basic things like pull up, you know, the charts, like the one year, the three year, the max. Um, you can also pull up like the more in depth charts for like, you know, the buying and selling candlesticks and whatnot, which is uh, pretty self-explanatory. You know, it's the same as everywhere else, right? Now, even though I'm on the desktop version for eToro Crypto, it, it does look just as good on your phone. I mean, I use the mobile app more often, but they've got some other cool concepts on here too. They've got copy traders, which is basically like looking at some of the most profitable crypto traders on uh, eToro, which is really cool. So kind of back to that whole social aspect of this. So you can actually like copy their trades, see what they got, things like that. It's pretty cool. And then, um, They've also got like these portfolios. They're like indexes of cryptos that you can buy into on here. So you can kind of see that they're going for like a different vibe, I guess you can say from a lot of the other uh, crypto exchanges. They're trying to like be unique, bring that whole social aspect into it. And to be honest with you, I was actually really excited to get started here like six months ago because they had just opened up to the US. And, um, you know, you can see I've made money here. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's been a good experience. I mean, I did have 1500 at one point, like I said, but I had to kind of get rid of it. Now, I do want to actually go over some coins I would recommend checking out on here, not financial advice. But I think Cardano would actually be good to get into because I think it still has a lot of room to go up. And it's also available for the staking rewards where they pay you out like once a month just for owning it. Just depends on how much you own. I also like Bitcoin Cash. Um, I don't own any of this here, but I do think this is a good coin based on, you know, the fact that it's like a top 15 crypto and it hasn't had a big run yet. So, you know, I actually put a lot of money into this one on a couple other exchanges, like $50,000. So I'm hoping that one goes up pretty soon. And of course, I like Tron, right? I mean, even though it's up a lot right now, uh, I think we could easily see it get to 15 cents and maybe even a little bit higher by the end of the year. That's what I'm hoping anyways. I do plan on holding this because like I said, I also get those staking rewards on it as well. Okay, anyways, uh, bottom line, guys, um, I really do think, uh, you know, eToro Crypto is a nice exchange. Uh, you know, uh, I do want to get some more money into it. I just haven't had the time to do that yet, but overall, you know, I definitely recommend using it. So if you want to check it out, I'll throw some uh, bonus and sign up links in both the description and comments. Please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel for more crypto content. We'll see you in the next one.